Hello everybody, welcome back to another Dokkan Battle video. And today we're going to be doing the new Super Battle Road stages. Uh, specifically the Universe 7 stage of the 10 new Super Battle Road stages. So, if we go on, I didn't actually have this pulled up. Uh, let's go ahead and see other options that you will be able to bring. Uh, you're going to bring this AJO God Goku, he's okay, nothing too special. And you Ultra Instinct Goku, he's actually a little underrated now in my opinion. I definitely feel like he's a very, very good option you could bring. Actually, instead of Blue Kalkin, I'm actually going to bring the 17 here. 17 gives Durkin and 6% defense to everyone. Very, very good unit. Um, the Spit Boo obviously is a must run. <laughs> you need to run this guy. He's very, very good. 50% chance to dodge. He gets stunned. And 300% attack and defense for 7 turns. It's crazy. This guy is basically, if you don't have... Goku and Freezer, like I do, you have to run this guy. He's pretty much the best Universe 7 category leader uh, that you could really run besides Goku and Frieza. Blue Evolution Vegeta is very good. Um, he still has to build up a little, but he could still do four attacks in a turn. He also has sturdy effect. is very, very awesome. Uh, Super Saiyan Blue Cow Ken Goku, he's actually pretty good. He gets 59% um, attack and defense at, at the start of turn, and then he gets an additional 59% attack and defense for the first 10 turns, which is, you know, not bad for Extreme Super Battle Road, or for Nola Super Battle Road even, but he does lose 10% HP, so you have to consider that as well. This 18 I'm bringing because she's really good defensively, raises defense by 30%, 10k defensive stat, she creates orbs, and then she gets attack 12% and defense 70% per orb, with the baseline of 70% attack and defense. Very good. You could consider running this guy, he does lower attack and superclass allies and enemies, but again, the allies part will be a little detrimental to your own team uh and no don't run this guy i i, I, never, I never even finished farming <laughs> all right um that's basically all i have to say you could also run in um a stair ultra instinct goku if you have him he's very good but let's just go ahead and hop in i do not know how hard these stages are at all it's gonna be my first time running this stage seems we're against against universe two uh I don't know what universe this is again. I like ele this is eleven. I think this is universe ten. So universe ten, two, and eleven. Okay, this is like basically the first fight of the universe for Evil Saga Super Battle Road. I well actually, let's let's see how hard they hit. Let's go ahead and attack you, and you're going to attack Basil, and you're gonna lower his attack. Let's see how well we do no items. We're probably going to get killed, to be really honest. Yeah, super attack at the beginning is not good at all. Um, That's going to hurt. Ooh, yeah, they hit, they hit so much harder than, uh, well, then against Blue Cow Ken Goku, who's not really good defensively. So we're definitely probably going to have to hop back in again. I will go ahead and, yeah. Okay, so this is very bad <laughs> luck, uh, obviously. This is not good luck at all. Let's go ahead and hop back in. Look at that. Yeah. Definitely going to use an item first turn next time. Uh, or not risk having blue cow can like that. <laughs> Alright. Once this finally loads through. Yeah, this is my first time playing that stage. And yeah, pretty hard. Yeah, uh, they hit a lot harder than normal Super Battle Road stages have in the past. So this is, a, I wouldn't say, it doesn't seem as difficult as Extreme Super Battle Road specifically. But it could be um, if we go more and more into the stage. So I'm actually going to keep it like this. Well, I do have two physical attacks at the start. I'm going to do this for now. We're going to use a Whis. We're going to... Uh, I can't get the 18D with Goku and Frieza, huh? That's unfortunate. So we're going to go ahead and just attack you. And give you these and Krillin. I believe Krillin has a medium chance to stun. I he lowers attack and has a medium chance to stun. So we're going to attack. Who's on the next turn? Seventeen, Boo, and eighteen. We're gonna attack. No, Boo will be fine. Let's attack you. Yeah. Okay. And let's see how it goes. I use a Whis this time, and yeah, tanking a lot better. Super Saiyan Blue Cow can. He needs to get attacked a little before he gets really good. The best thing about him in, in Super Battle Road in general is his Spirit Bomb. So once he gets his Spirit Bomb off, that's going to be very, very useful. Yeah, even with the Whis, look how much damage he's taking. 
I don't know, man. I would just blue cow can. He's just not built for this event, personally. Like, outside of the spirit bomb, not good. I'll definitely see that. Probably should have kept Krillin. Uh, Krillin has a medium chance to dodge. He lowers the attack for Goku and Frieza. He has shocking speed as well. Tournament of power. And he did stun right there, so that's very nice. And let's keep, obviously, Boo here. I'm going to keep attacking Bergamo. It doesn't really matter what I give 18 this time. Let's keep attacking Bergamo and let's uh, let's lower your attack because I kind of want Goku and Frieza to attack you next turn. And Boo will be just fine, especially with the Whis up. He's not going to take any damage. I should have checked his defensive stat, but he's probably around like 300k defense or so, which, you know, obviously is very good. <laughs> and no stun, unfortunately. This Boo, again, he has a high chance to dodge attacks for seven turns and he also I believe has a medium chance to stun on a super attack actually we probably should have targeted Bergamo we could have killed Bergamo there but I'll let Blue Cow can go ahead and do that next turn and we have all of their attack lowered now as well so it's gonna be very helpful in terms of getting attacks up I'm gonna have to actually put Blue Cow can first we're going to attack oof I might have to do this defensively wise nah. let's attack you and maybe we'll get crits or something i don't know let's just go there um his attack is lowered as well and then we're gonna lower his attack against goku and frieza okay oh that's not good at all <laughs> that's really not good ouch yeah 260k oh and his passive is fully built up and he's still taking that much damage so i think we're dead here i mean Probably our dead here, which is very unfortunate. This stage is harder than I thought, huh? Uh, well, it might be alive because um, Basil's attack is lowered. Um, well, we're about to lower Basil's attack right here. Lavender is already has his attack lowered. Oh, well. Actually, we should be good. If Blue if Blue Evolution gets a crit, well, we're good. That's the thing. And then I'll probably use an item again next turn. Actually, Blue Evolution should kill him even without any crits. Come on. Yeah, there we go. Additional super? Nope. That's fine. That's fine. And actually, we should be fine here. I'm going to give you these. I actually want to keep Krillin here. Yeah, we're going to do that. It's because type advantage. And then they could dodge. And I won't have to use an item this turn. And then we could potentially just use a spirit bomb next turn as well, which will be very helpful. Because spirit bomb obviously is super powerful. And we'll finally have 17 Goku and Frieza together. Can you dodge this for me? No. Oh, okay. We did get the dodge. Perfect. We could even stun him with Krillin. Krillin is so good. <laughs> like, in these stages. And we have a lot of attack learning going on. So, he's dead. Oh, I hope 18 gets it an additional. I wish I gave 18 more orbs then. Dang. She could have killed him here. Is he dead? Oh, he's dead. Perfect. We could use a spirit bomb next turn. Oh, that's great. This is working out actually really good. Um, we'll use a spirit bomb with Boo Cow Ken, of course. I'm not sure what the typings are of these guys. We'll use the Spirit Bomb against Spirit Boot. And... Okay, we we'll only have one physical. We have a bunch of AGL, but there's no tech. Well, actually, Goku and Frieza could be in big trouble with her. So we're going to do this. We're going to attack Rubrian. Um, We don't really have too many tech units. We do have a lot of AGL units, so uh, Rubrian herself won't be a problem. Uh, Kakunsa won't be a problem either. She's AGL, and we don't have many, well, SDR units at all, except for Blue Cow Ken, and then 17 right here also has this damage reduction. We're going to use this. I'm going to lower your attack. We're going to have Goku and Frieza still attack her as well. We're going to have Blue Cow Ken attack her as well. Okay, I think that's a good deal. 17 has his damage reduction as well, so he's not going to take anything from here. We could potentially take her out this turn, which would be very, very good, because then we could have both Boo's attack. We could have Boo and Krillin attack Ribrian, which would be nice. Uh, Boo and Krillin actually share a decent amount of links. They share a tournament of power. They, oh, the additional is super good. We could probably... If Goku and Frieza gets crit, she's done for sure. Uh, Boo and Krillin, I believe they share shocking speed, tournament of power, and first battle, which is very nice. Okay, this won't do too much because 17 does has 40% damage reduction with the item. Yeah, only 100k is not bad. 8.6 million. <laughs> okay, she's dead. Even without a crit, she's probably dead. 
I don't know. It's been a while since I really used Goku and Frieza since I don't actually own them myself. But seeing them do this, do this is so insane. And the worry is, okay, so Blue Cap and Goku, he's not going to get supered by... Oh, yeah, we also have the Spirit Bomb active skill. I forgot about that. He's not going to get supered by... um. Oh, additional super. That's very nice. We're not going to get supered by Cocoon, as I was going to say. So that's the biggest worry. Ruby Ryan could super, but I don't think I'll die because I have the item active. Yeah, no, we're, we're fine. We're fine. And we also have 17 on rotation. Okay, so we're obviously going to do this. Oh, look at that team. <laughs> he went down 7. Okay, we do have the item active right here. But that's very good. Um, We're going to attack Ruby Ryan until she's dead, probably. We're just going to get rid of Ruby Ryan here. I think that's the smartest move. Um, because 17 will uh, probably not have his damage reduction next turn. So we want to make sure that Ribrian's taken down. Because then Goku and Frieza could just easily wipe the floor with Kakun stuff. Yeah, this... Oh, yeah. She's stunned too. It's over. <laughs> this is over. Uh, it, honestly, I probably should have attacked Kakun with... Um, I forgot his name again. Fit Boo. But, again, we probably wouldn't have been able to take her out. Uh, well, Blue... Blue Evolution does do a lot of damage for sure. And if it gets additional super, that'd be very helpful. No, unfortunately not. So we're actually going to put Goku and Frieza here. Even though I want to get all those orbs, it's probably the best move. And we're going to go ahead and heal up with 18. And that'll be very nice. Yeah, 18 gets very high, very high defense. Luckily, they didn't super first turn. Uh, the only unfortunate thing is that we couldn't left super. We're going to have 17 lower her attack first, but that's not too big of a deal. If they get a crit here, she's going to lose. Oh, jeez. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no, she's dead. They just, <laughs> we just finished off. Uh, they really finished off Kakuza in just one turn like that, huh? Yeah, that's crazy. Uh, Goku and Frieza, when they're against an AGO opponent, is clearly just over. That's 100% <laughs> positive. Uh, unfortunately, we won't be able to get the Spirit Bomb here against Jiren. I don't know if it's Jiren by himself. No, just three enemies. Tech. Ooh, that's unfortunate. Ooh, the tech is unfortunate. We're definitely going to use... I'm actually going to use an Usher here. Even though we have a bunch of Dodgers. Um, There's some Dispo attacks in the back slot. We're going to try and do this against Jiren. I think I want to take out Jiren as fast as possible. Because we have three AGO units and that's not good. Topo is a little bit of a problem for Goku and Frieza. But 17 won't be able to hand him a little... Dispo, uh, Goku and Frieza will definitely just demolish. We could get a Dokkan attack very soon. I might have to get it with Fitbu because I don't think I can get it next turn. Uh, unfortunately, I wish I could get it next turn. And I hope Krillin stuns. Krillin, please stun for me. Oh, perfect. Okay, great. We got that stun. So then hopefully Dispo and Topo don't attack in the same slots multiple times. If like Dispo attacks slot one, we'll see... Okay, so I'm, I definitely have to put 17 first, and I have to put you there. Okay, this is going to be tough. I might have to... I'll, I'll go ahead and... I'll just use a Whis, honestly. We have so many items, it doesn't matter. I'd rather not die. <laughs> That'd probably be the best thing to do. We're going to attack Dispo here. We're going to go all out on Dispo. And then next turn, we should get a Dokkan attack. Probably we'll have to get it with Fibu, unfortunately, but it is what it is. 17 might take some damage. Ooh, okay, this is going to be a lot of damage here. Yikes. Okay, I'm just, we should, we're fine, we're fine. Even if Topo supers me, he's only supering 17 because he's not attacking anywhere else but the first slot. We should be A-OK. -okay. And we did lower Dispo's attack as well. Yeah, we're, we're fine because Topo is not going to super again. Okay, okay. And Jiren's stun, obviously. So hopefully we get another stun against Jiren next turn. Let's keep Jiren stunned until we could actually have Goku and Frieza attack. Goku and Frieza should be able to finish off Dispo here. If not, Vegeta will. Yeah, Vegeta is definitely going to finish off Dispo. Very nice, very nice. Um, overall, the stage will actually wasn't too difficult. You do have to use some items, of course, to protect yourself. But, I mean, it's super battle road. What do you really expect? Yeah, it wasn't really too difficult, honestly. Pretty easy so far. I mean, we're not done yet, but, I mean... Topo, oh, he has a lot of health. So we're going to go ahead and use this. Okay, I'm going to attack Jiren with you. I'm actually going to attack Topo with you. And I'm going to get a Dokkan attack, so I'm just going to... I don't want to grab all his tech orbs, though. But I kind of have to. 
Three keys defense. Yeah, I kind of have to grab all these tech orbs. Unfortunately, you're going to tech Jiren as well. I wish I could have saved those for Goku and Frieza, but 18 needs that defense. Especially with Topo attacking a million times in the back slot. Uh, luckily, we do have a Zoken attack. I gave it to Boo because, one, Boo obviously will hit a lot harder than Krillin. My Boo's rainbow, my Krillin's at 55%. So, Boo can get his crits and everything. And even at 55%, Boo will just hit a lot harder than Krillin because Boo has 300% attacking defense at the start of turn, of course. And Boo also dodges, so he's better in the first slot. It just makes more sense. Okay. I attack Jiren to possibly get the stun. I am also attacking Topo to possibly. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. Did I use a. Okay. I definitely had to use a Whis and then I healed up. Yeah, I think last turn. I yeah, last turn I used a Whis and then I used a 30% uh, snake. So actually, I didn't need to get 18 of those orbs. Ah. Oh, I'm very dumb. And Topo's done anyway. So yeah, we're gonna. Put 17 here. Actually, we're gonna attack. No, Tobo stunned. Yeah, we're gonna put 17 here. Um, I do not have any items up. Do I wanna risk not using it? We just supered. I don't risk it. Whatever. I don't even think if he supers me, I'll die. Okay. Oh, that's a lot of damage. But we're gonna take him out. So we're all good. I'd rather. I want to use as little of the items as possible, of course, because the flex. And 17 double super, so <laughs> he's not going to do a lot of damage. He might do damage against Blue Cow Can if we get there. But, I mean, not too much damage. Goku and Frieza is going to do a lot here, obviously. Take a swig of water there. How much is this going to be? Yeah, oh, hmm. He might have to get an additional. If, I, if I'm dead here, I'm gonna be so salty. Oh uh, no. Okay. He's dead. He's dead. He's dead for sure. Whew, I risked it there. If Jiren supered me, even with the triple attack lowering, I don't think I would have survived, <laughs> to be honest. We're definitely gonna have Boo attack here. We're gonna have Krillin get his super. Um, we're gonna do this. That should be good for the blue. Alright. We could realistically finish off Topo here. Um, I, think, I think it's a good time to start wrapping up the video. So, unless Boo doesn't do anything. Oh, he stunned him again. Oh, he got the additional. Yeah, it's over. So, yeah, this is a Universe 7 stage of a Super Battle Road. Again, the new 10 stages that were added just last night. This Universe 7 stage, honestly, is pretty easy. I didn't even have an UI Goku. Krillin's super effective. I. Forget. Oh yeah, if the enemy's done, I think Krillin is super effective. So that's very good too. You have to consider that. Oh, Topo was stunned. I definitely could have gotten a super effective Dokkan attack. It's whatever, it's whatever. Uh, it's already in the past. We already won. I didn't have any UI Goku or my own Goku and Frieza. So if you do have those units, that's going to be a huge help. Because any UI Goku is 70% chance. Not int. STR, Ultra Instinct, Sign Goku, 70% chance to dodge is huge. And see, this is my first clear. Very easy stage. Thank you guys for watching, like, share, subscribe, let me know what you think about the new stages in the comments below, and I'll see you all next time.